Well, there isn't an Eastern Iowa area team quite on a roll like the Clear Creek Amana girls basketball team. The Clear Creek Amana girls basketball team remains undefeated on the season with an 11 and 0 record. Play, 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 play. The Clippers rank second in the state in class 4A right behind the defending state champions. When I first started, you know, we were kind of at the bottom, we're the bottom feeders and where we're at now, yeah, we've always been doing the chasing and now we're being the chase. 8 out of their 12 players on their roster are seniors, which has helped them come out on top in some big games, including their 21 point victory at Solon last month. Last time when we were at their place, they uh, beat us by about 20, so we kind of made it our mission to kind of um, give it right back to them. That really helped us a lot and gained some confidence and they're our rivals, so it's always nice to beat them. Between a six foot two, Bliss Beck and 5'11", Ava Locklear, CCA has a big presence on the inside. We just have such a good team dynamic. We work so well together. We never really have any like, I want to score my points. Like we, we share the ball really well. But to pull off another major win against Mount Vernon just nine days ago, the Clippers turned to their perimeter shooting and a sophomore. Oh, she makes it. We have so many weapons on this team, and like for that Mount Vernon game, you know, I think Lena really stepped up. I don't think we could have won without her. Lena had a huge game. I'm so proud of her. She had some big threes, and I think that's what really helped us. This CCA team understands what it takes to win. It's just not about one or two players. It's about a collective effort, and um, whether you're a starter or reserve, um, whatever your role is, everybody's, you know, pulling in the same direction. Last season, the Clippers made it to the state quarterfinals, plus a handful of players were also a part of the 46-1 state qualifying volleyball team. We got so far in state and like once you get that taste, you know, you don't want to let it go. So I think that just definitely translated over to basketball. Knowing what they've accomplished so far, they've got a countdown to remind them of their ultimate goal. We keep a countdown of like the state uh, championship game. We say it's like however many Saturdays until now. I think right now we're sitting at about, you know, uh, 45 days.